Right, just a quick video just to show you how to open this up. So um, obviously with the arrows pointing up, that's, that's how it should be facing because this is the upside. Get a drill or screwdriver. Uh, screwdriver might take a little while, but you want to undo all these. on each other, place it aside, and then you will have your accessories here on top, the DC charger, uh, the wall mounts, put them aside, and this is going to be screwed in, it's not at the moment, but it will be, so this is just to hold the sword in place, so it doesn't lift, and uh, so it does, these do not contact the top side, so unscrew the screws here, and lift it up, and you can see it's got padding here to push it down. And then over here, there's another bit of padding to prevent the sword coming up here as well. And last one here for the sword tip. Now you've got those two out of the way, you can actually lift it. And the way you want to lift it is... I forgot which way actually. Yeah, the top side first. So grab the, grab the uh, tip and start lifting it slowly, very gently. Because these bones, although they're glued in place, you still want to be careful with them. You don't want to dislodge them, so lift the tip. And start, you can start shifting both sides because that's always put in. So it's put in uh, the, guard, uh, the, um, the pommel first, like adjust it in position here. Can you show here? The pommel in here, and then you push it in place. So, so you see these bones align sort of with these. There you go, see? So that's how it, it sits in place. Just remove it one more time. And then you can remove the tip, and that's pretty much it. That's it, ready. And you can keep the box if you need it for more travel to transport into other locations. This has got a nice tip here. Insert. Yeah, and I'm just gonna put it back in. So the pommel, pommel side first, so it sits into the foam. And then carefully adjust it till it slides in place.